Good evening, everybody. On a Wednesday evening, it is now officially considered the Christmas holiday because tomorrow being Christmas Eve, meaning the day after Christmas. So two days left to go till Christmas. Can you believe it? 2009, it's almost over. It's hard to believe. If you're going to be doing any traveling tomorrow to get ready for the holiday, flying out of Lehigh Valley International Airport, Northeastern Hubs, we don't have too many problems. Maybe if you like effect snow f showers in Buffalo, it will be cold at 28. Boston, D.C., partly sunny in the 30s. Cleveland, some clouds with an approaching storm. Heading to the Midwest, this is where we have problems. Blizzard from Minneapolis at 26. St. Louis, heavy snow, 30. Memphis, thunderstorms at 51 degrees. Chicago, we'll see some rain. Detroit, cloudy and wind as storm approach, as the storm approaches. Down south, no problems, really. Orlando, sunny in the 70s. Tallahassee, some clouds in the 70s. Charlotte, sunny. Atlanta, some showers. With this uh, arrival of our next storm, the timing got pushed back, so it looks like it is going to be all rain for us and a lot of it. We could see easily one to two inches of rain from the system, even as it continues into Saturday. And then beyond that, our next chance of snow comes around New Year's Day, our latest model showing this storm for New Year's Day itself. High clouds tonight. It will be the coldest night so far this season. Overnight lows ranging from 11 to 16 degrees. Tomorrow, hey, what do you know? The transition works tonight. Clouds increasing late. Still a bit of a chill for your Christmas Eve day. 31 to 34 degrees. As we make our way through the next 10 days, rain moves in Friday, 39. Because the timing got pushed, no ice on the start. Saturday, rain heavy at times, 44. Sunday, clouds break, 40. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, sunny and cold and then by next thursday friday new year's eve new year's day there is that chance of snow by day 10 temperatures turn sharply colder in the 20s that is your forecast for today i will see you tomorrow